What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the Eclectic Beard. So this go round, we've got funniest in innuendos of all time from this morning. Um, innuendos are funny. When if you see stuff, when if you see innuendos that happen, whether on purpose or by accident, depending on the setting, can wind up with just some hilarious results. I'm hoping that's what happens here, especially unintentional stuff. The unintentional stuff is. I think that's the funniest because a lot of times a person says something, it involves innuendo and then they realize after they've said it, but normally because they see other people snickering, that to me is the funniest type of innuendos because they're not, you, you just, you often think and you don't, sometimes it's not, it doesn't come out the way you intended or it comes out and it, the way it sounded in your head doesn't, doesn't sound the same way coming out. So the unintended consequences of that for me is hilarious. I'm hoping hoping that's the case in this so let's get into it i know what you're gonna do not a big one i'm not eating a big one i need a little, oh that's a big one i can't i can't it's daytime <laughs> it breaks my rule well, come oh, on you God. shut your eyes and do it <laughs> this is lovely oh, don't, oh, look, at it. don't look at it don't look at it don't look at it go see it's all right when she when you once it's in i love it but nice, see? <laughs> hey, welcome back uh, uh, to this morning. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Once it's in. <laughs> oh, what are we talking about here? Are we talking about food or something else now? Welcome back uh, uh, to this morning. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, dear. <laughs> uh, I love to come to the show. I love to do the show. <laughs> oh, I've missed you. <laughs> <laughs> you, this must be. <laughs> I think the reaction of the guests, her being unable to keep it together, it's one of the funnier things. Because as soon as she said it, the look on their faces, she's like, "Oh shit, did I just say that?" You, you can't say that around guys on a construction site, much less a TV show. I'm <laughs> just saying. <laughs> so, I love to come to the show. I love to do the show. <laughs> oh, I missed you. <laughs> <laughs> you, this must be all your dreams come true because you've been. I mean, you say that this uh, sort of seed was sown back when you were doing Comet Relief and you dressed up as the characters and you did it then, but this actual seed was sown in your bedroom when you were. Um, <laughs> 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 that one guy, what? <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. And I love getting down and dirty, really. <laughs> and you did it then, but this actual seed was sown in your bedroom when you were a young... Beg you, I beg your pardon. I was, I was making <laughs> seeds in your bedroom. Hang on a minute, you've just been eating salty worms. You're on about seeds in bed. What is, what is happening to this show? <laughs> yes, I was planting <laughs> seeds in my bedroom when I was a child thinking of Paddy McGuinness. Get me rolling on the phone immediately. <laughs> This is gone wrong. What's the matter with you? What's the matter with you? <laughs> the matter with you? Oh my god! <laughs> what, dude? Oh, that has to be one of the reasons why she is on the show or something. I, I, both, both clips so far, and it's her. So, I have a feeling this is going to be a recurring theme on this. <laughs> Seed was sown in your bedroom. <laughs> Funny turn of phrase there. What's the, what was I doing with seeds? No, what? stop. It's the margarita. No, stop I getting Ollie you. drunk. <laughs> <laughs> you can't make this up it's not. What I was saying was, is that it's been a real passion project for you. It's been a dream come oh, true. <laughs> 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 it has been a oh, passion project. You know God. what I mean? Oh, it has been a passion God. project. Oh, yes. Right, so yes. Gino's here and he's got an Italian toy. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Can I just say something? You yes. know how you say don't mess with Italian recipes? No. Can I just say, Toad in the Hole is one of my favourites. What shenanigans are you putting First in First of all, I'm not making Toad in the Hole. This is sausage in a hole. It's not <laughs> a Toad in a hole. <laughs> and what, so makes, what makes your the sausage bit Italian? Uh, is thicker. <laughs> Is uh, uh, tastier <laughs> and uh, he's got fans. Bro, <laughs> oh, this this is definitely intentional. No. 
It's got fennel. <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, that's it. Uh, suddenly, it's Italian. So, sorry. <laughs> This is my interpret in, uh, interpretation. interpretation of the uh, sausage in the hole. Toad in the hole. Sausage in the hole. Does toad offend you? Can no, you but sausage in the hole sounds fantastic. <laughs> 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 you go home and the wife says, what do you, oh, I want the sausage in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I tell everybody my favorite game to play with my wife is hide the sausage. So I get it, homie. Sausage in the hole is fantastic. Roll. Let's do that. <laughs> should we save him now? Or should we just let him dig the hole? He's lost deeper? in translation. <laughs> you can tell. <laughs> Stop. Have you ever hit anything that you've been throwing at? Funnily enough, I've never willy wanged since then. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> I, however, haven't stopped. <laughs> you know, I've got a, I've got a nephew. Called oh, Will, God. and as we were talking about this earlier, I said after that, I said that Sam and Jack and I went welly wanging with Will, and Will was welly wanging. Yeah, it's not easy to and say. It's not easy, and I said, don't make that mistake, Holly. <sighs> Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please do me. I know we haven't got time to do it now, but can you just stay and do me? So absolutely. And we'll just cut to an interval just now. With, with my do me? Oh my god. Uh. Oops, we ch uh, chop it all yep. up, we stick it in a pan, add some water, and then when, when it's all cooked, we just you stick do that. It. Yeah, do I get the same? Go on. It does it spray all around you? No, no, not the, the stick bender, no. No, with the no, stick, no. with the mirror. Liquidizer does. It's all right. Yeah. But no, I've never whizzed it over the kitchen. No. <laughs> Should I have not? <laughs> <laughs> I love that, Nick. Thank you. Pleasure, my pleasure. <laughs> <Thank> my pleasure. <laughs> Steph really doesn't approve. Bro, bro, oh my god! What, uh, what channel is this? What channel is this show? Come on, I need to. I need to find it in the morning before I start my recording. Props, Gene. We should have to pull off the new. <laughs> We're just speaking random words. Put them in a sentence, for goodness sake. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even suit your age, that's coming what? up next. <laughs> <laughs> what? God. Put them in a sentence, for goodness sake. <laughs> God. Don't even suit your age, that's coming what? up next. <laughs> <laughs> Put it back to the beginning. Oh, oh gosh, really? This is like a test now. Right. Still to come from cropped jean to the boyfriend fit. fit. <laughs> <laughs> we show you how to pull off the new denim trends, whatever your age. That's yeah. what I said. Marvellous. These are uh, a brand called Warmies, and these are lovely. Put them in the microwave, hit them up. This is the llama. Heat them up, not hit them up. Hit them up. Uh, really hit them down up. with the kids. This was like, yeah, I'm very down with the kids, Holly. <laughs> this is like a, a muff, and it uh, smells of lavender. <laughs> lovely, so relaxing yeah. also. Who knew my muff smelled of lavender, but it's really <laughs> nice, and that's 11 .99, and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know, oh, I'm just going to get Alan. into more and more trouble. <laughs> what is? What are you doing? <laughs> you're digging yourself a massive hole. It's you're throwing us all in it. You put your hands in it and you keep warm. <gasps> <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> oh. Right, well, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bring you for a chance. So, <clears throat> all I hear is the word muff, and I say, wait, 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 what? <laughs> you're digging yourself a massive hole. <laughs> lavender, but it's really... <laughs> it smells of lavender. <laughs> Love. This is like a, a muff, and <laughs> it's... Uh, Smells of lavender. <laughs> Lovely, so relaxing yeah. also. Yeah, yeah, hole. definitely. I mean, he's talking about you digging yourself a massive hole and throwing us all in it. I mean, <clears throat> yeah, anyways, we'll go on from that. Uh, in this very studio, I'm going to take you right behind oh, there. Oh, right now, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's my lucky day. Okay. <laughs> Hi. For Chinese takeaway. Oh, good. Yeah, in this very studio. I'm going to take you right behind okay. there. Hi, now, okay. Uh, <laughs> it's my lucky day. Okay. I mean, that's in, the, in the kitchen. In the kitchen, right behind On Friday, there. that's what we call right. it, folks. 
So <laughs> we've got Ching showing you how to make a Friday night takeaway, and that's where we're going. That's okay? where we're going. Right you after this. Right after this. <laughs> you better get into it now. We're off. We're to the party now. What's the name of that street? Where are you? I am at Takashita Street in Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought so. Thanks Thank very you. much indeed, Lisa. Have fun. <laughs> Is it you want to Italian? Tweet? Is it Italian? What do you call that twiddling action? A twiddling action. What when do I call twiddle, it? When you twiddle, is there an Italian Forchettare. word? Forchettare. Forchettare. <laughs> ah, there you go. <laughs> Glad you asked that. <laughs> Forchettare. Yeah. Fuck it. You fork it. You fork it. Whatever you want. You just have just, to twist it away. Just uh -huh. the way he said it, for us, it fast. He's yeah, saying I didn't fork want to say, it, but she did ask about three times, and I was thinking, yeah. don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, what's it's also really brilliant nice. is the fact that we it's forgot to nice. put the wine in. Yeah, no, but he, no, no, salute, salute. If you can just feel this energy from anywhere, what happens if you're like in a supermarket and suddenly you start getting this energy in? I mean, have you, has it ever happened to you in an inappropriate place? Um, well, first of all, I don't really feel like any place is inappropriate. <laughs> Second of all, it's a conscious thing. Yeah. So Tantra teaches us to be conscious about it, so we get to choose to do it. It, it's it doesn't like, happen to us, we choose it. You can it. tone it down, or, you know, so it could be a low-level vibration, like we could even be doing that now without, you, you know, it being Are you too doing that now? crazy. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little bit. Oh, but then, um, and then we can rev it up. And yeah, if we're like at the really high intense states, then I'm not really functional, but it only gets that intense, um, you know, about once a month because we, yeah. we can't Bearing schedule mind, 12 hour, 18 hour experiences. Uh, this has been one of my favorite interviews ever. Just gonna, <laughs> gonna point that out. Um, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks guys. I'm not sure I've asked everything I need to know. No, yet. we've got thousands of things we I'll still have to. I'll I've, call you. I've only got halfway through this. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Oh, so um, Thank staticarts.com if you want to learn how to do it. Okay. Oh, oh there you go. <laughs> Just write that down. <laughs> Bro, that's. It sounds like. It looks, it looks like that might have been a weird interview. Oh, oh my. Uh, uh, Still to come. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect, perfect way to end that. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> who's it like that on last season? <laughs> Go to the right. <laughs> um, this is what you do with it, okay? Feel this, it's super cozy, and you can... Strap it on. Oh, oh it's a strap on. It's a strap on. <laughs> you knew it was going to be. All oh, we need now is Frankie Howard, don't we? <laughs> She's evil. I'm good, and she wants to get her hands on my dick, and I'm not having it. No, yet. I'm not surprised. So. Well, when you uh, run right, right the word go, you have a fantastic entrance. Thank you very much, <laughs> and the show as well. <laughs> Oh my God, dude. Oh my God. Just so much. In it. Just... Oh my God. I'm talking about get hands on dick and a fantastic entrance. Like, in which way are we talking about here? <laughs> how do you, how do you, uh, how do you get in? On a bell. <laughs> on a giant bell. I, it's giant bell swings in and I'm clinging to it, are Philip, you? for dear life. <laughs> And I come down and I sing, you can ring my bell. Yes. Which it's is... what the public wants. <laughs> and there's a few more to go. Yeah, there's three out already. Uh, <laughs> you're not well. Do you oh, need... Oh, sorry, no, I've got something. I don't know what's happened. You need to suck a fisherman's friend, <laughs> don't you? <laughs> it's a matter of urgency. You guess that would help. <laughs> Shall we get you one? No. Let's just talk about something else. Um, <laughs> touring, are you... I'm fine. Suddenly I've recovered very quickly. <laughs> <laughs> when are you when are you touring next? Oh, I am I would know. <laughs> All right, there we have it. There we have it. I'm going to stop this before it gets to the whole other stuff that these channels normally do for looking at other videos. Oh my god, dude, this is a morning show. It says ITV.
I'm about to find this show a watch just cause some of this stuff is too, too funny. Um, but I, it, and it's, it says unintentional things or those things that just kind of left hanging in the air. Um, where it's like somebody realizes three seconds after said like, wait, what? That, no, 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 no. And the hilarity starts ensuing. That's it. There's plenty of that in this. Oh my God, this is too funny. That being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Y'all be good to each other. Love yourselves. Peace.